The license manager is where you can see all mobile and desktop licenses that have been generated for your account. What you see on this page will vary by what you are using on your gateway account. On the account we're looking at today, we only have mobile devices, but you could see desktop swipers here as well. These licenses will be generated by the devices you are using to process through iProcess, our desktop swipe application, and QuickBooks SyncPay. As you can see, I have one active license and it is a mobile device license right now. For mobile devices, the device nickname will be whatever you entered in iProcess during setup, the license number is generated by the gateway, and you can see when it was added. Additionally, at the bottom, we have a link to show deleted device licenses. If I click this, I can see I had another license with the same name that was generated a day earlier and I had deleted it. If you ever need it, we also show the timestamp for when it was deleted, the user account who did it, and the IP address where it was done from. If you want to delete a current license, you hit the recycling bin here. We'll give you a warning and you hit OK and now it has been deleted and you can see this one as well. The same would be true for any other license that you have and other types such as our desktop ones will show up as tabs at the top of the screen. A few quick notes about licenses. If you delete a license, it will not prevent the device that was using that license from working in the future. It simply means you will not be billed for that license. Whenever you try to run a transaction through one of your encrypted devices, it will check the gateway account to see if you have any active licenses for this device. If you do, it won't do anything different. If you do not, then it will create a new license on the spot. Additionally, all licenses are based on the number of devices you are plugging readers into, not the number of readers that you have. As an example, if you have three phones that are all sharing one mobile card reader, that will generate three licenses even though you are using one reader for all three phones. Again, the same holds true for any desktop swipers you are using as well. It's not the number of swipers that you have, but the computers you are plugging them into.